the first sip I took, 10 out of 10. It tasted really, really good and kind of unbelievable that, you know, it has the macros it does. But, hey guys, Zep Productions here. In this video, I'm taking a look at Control, which is a meal replacement that stands for Catered to Real Life. And it might be one of the best things I've ever stumbled upon. This is a meal replacement that's themed after cereals. This is the cookies and cream version. 20 servings, 3 pound bag of this. Found it on Amazon for 50 bucks. Same day shipping. Great macros on this. 23 grams of protein, 5 grams fiber, 23 vitamins and minerals, 280 calories. Really beautiful and intriguing artwork on this. Two scoops, shake, and then you enjoy. I love the packaging on this. Like, I've already said this, but this is 10 out of 10. It's really nice. Catered to real life, and here's all the people it caters to. Families, gym goers, athletes, adventurers, gamers. Gaming is like the most uh, focus that this has. Here's the back. I'm not going to read all of this. You guys can pause and read this if it interests you. Supplement facts and all. And this is co-owned by FaZe, if I'm not mistaken, but FaZe does have a part in this for sure. I will leave a link down in the description below if you guys would like to purchase on Amazon because this arrived literally the same day with Prime. Here's all the ingredients. Here's all the supplement facts of this. Nutrition facts. You guys can go ahead and read those. 400 calories with skim milk. And you shouldn't really be making this in water. It should be made in milk because that's like what this is. More of like a milkshake. Beautiful packaging. Third time saying that just to emphasize how nice the packaging actually looks. And I'm not even going to lie. That's the main reason why I bought it. And for taste, of course, too. Because I've heard good things about this. This is the cookies and cream variant, as you can see. And it has real cookie pieces in it. There's also a bunch of other flavors. If you click the link in the description, you can see. The other flavors they have is Apple Smack, Cinnamon Toast, Cocoa Crunch, Birthday Cake, and Fruity Flakes. They have a bunch of different flavors, but this one was the one that could arrive the fastest. I wanted the Cocoa Crunch, but this one has chocolate in it, so it'll do. And this is supposed to be marketed as healthy, but I would by no means call this healthy at all. Because yes, if you look at the macros, you're like, okay, there's barely any sugar. 3 grams of added sugar. Um, and it's low carbohydrates, you know, all good stuff, high protein is great. That's only half of this story. You have to look at the whole ingredients. The ingredients list is pretty iffy, but let's just be honest. This is healthier than, uh, other shakes, I guess you would find. Milkshakes, definitely healthier than a milkshake. Has great macros too. Like I said, it has added vitamins and minerals, so it's healthier, but I would not consume this with a mind saying that this is healthy. So don't think this is healthy, but it's healthier. Definitely a treat. Tastes great. Has stuff that's good for you too. So might as well enjoy. Two scoops and milk. Whole milk. That's what I put. So I put a little bit of milk first. Then put two scoops. And then I'm going to put on my uh, little s strainer thing. And then seal it back up. And I have pretty high hopes for this. Because this was pretty pricey. About two and a half dollars per serving. And this is a completely honest, unsponsored, unbiased review of this. So let's see how it tastes. I have high hopes for this. And the powder is really soft, so you're gonna mix it nice and well, and you don't even need a whole blender for it. Don't know where my fit is from, don't know what it cost it. You see me dripping my whole closet full of sauces. When you come off the strip, it's hard to stay legit. They saying that and this, but I'm still... Alright, it's all mixed up now. I mixed it for about 2-3 minutes and it looks pretty nice. It feels smooth and there's absolutely no chunks other than the cookie pieces that's supposed to be in there. So here's a taste test and first impressions, I have to give an absolute 10 out of 10. The first sip I took, 10 out of 10. It tasted really, really good and kind of unbelievable that, you know, it has the macros it does. But then the aftertaste kicks in, which is like... A weird really bitter chemical but it's, it's not like out there it's kind of like in the background like you're gonna feel it for a while it's not it's it is pretty heavy hitting but it's just in the back so it, it still tastes really good I'd give the product a 5 out of 10 considering ingredients and uh, taste I would recommend this but I would recommend you try the trial rather than buying the whole bag but it's good thanks so much for watching have a great day